when you bring plants from a nursery or when you get a stem cutting make sure to keep these plants in a shady corner in your place garden. plants at the right place they will grow really very healthily and beautifully rubber plant grows well in the shade easy to grow and low maintenance plant look at this so beautiful and it looks so tall one of the best house plants palm plants also are beautiful indoor plants they also love the shade so let's see the plants that you will have to take care and give them a special care and also a shady corner in your garden welcome friends welcome back to tamara's garden another gardening episode from my channel and also this is a shade loving plants video so stay tuned until the end to know all the list of plants so that you can also keep them in the shady corner in your garden and make sure you grow them very beautifully and healthily this is bamboo plant friends when you bring this bamboo plants from a nursery or when you get a stick from your friend keep it in a shady corner this is one of the plants that belongs to the family of dracaena and also they prefer the shade so keep it in a shady corner for their healthy growing these are variegated leafy plants so that you can allow them to get some medium to partial sunlight too so these plants are happy at the shady corner and also a little bit of sunlight will be okay syngonium plants they also grow well in the shade so these are beautiful house plants beautiful indoor plants you can grow them outdoors too so in your outdoor garden make sure they are in the shady corner Rosina variety and also I have this colorful decorative croton plants. Pothos plants grows well in the shady corner. They are also one of the best house plants. So keep the varieties of pothos plants in a corner of your garden in the shade. Another beautiful philodendron variety which is in a hanging pot is under a big tree. Polias plants grows well in the shade. I have these varieties with me. They look so colorful and also decorative. Beautiful Swiss cheese plant. One of the best house plants. Their leaf is amazing and looks so decorative. These plants also grows well in the shaded area. One of the beautiful low maintenance permanent plant beautiful bird nest plants see how amazing and green looking one of the evergreen plants for the shady corner you can keep it at an entrance or at a doorway and also this is a beautiful house plant they grow well in the shady area in your garden make sure to keep in a shade huge beautiful syngonium plant which is in a huge pot and it looks so bushy and elegant this plant also prefers the shade and grows well you can see how huge my pot and my planter is and also that is covered by syngonium plant. Prayer plant, one of the beautiful leafy plant. So green looking, you can keep it in the shade. Small leafy plant, Aralia. This is Aralia plant, which is a variegated leafy plant, ideal for indoor plant or else outdoor plant. You can keep it in the shade. Aglonema plants, if you can keep under a huge plant also, you can give them the shade. Beautiful and colorful. Umbrella plant. Umbrella plant also grows well in the shade. They love the partial to medium sunlight. They grow tall and they grow from stems. Very easy to maintain. Easy growing plant. Beautiful umbrella, variegated leafy plant beautiful golden philodendron i love this plant because of its look and the color it's amazing and it is one of the indoor plants low maintenance permanent and prefers the shade don't forget to keep it in the shady corner because this is well growing in the cover even if you keep it outdoors make sure they are not getting bright sunlight so this is one of the things that you'll have to keep in mind once you bring these plants from a nursery cast iron plant another plant for the shaded corner you can keep it in a shady corner in your garden they are very beautiful evergreen plants 
you can grow them very very beautifully in the shady corner in your garden they also love the partial to medium sunlight and also this is a plant where you don't need to regular water the beautiful variegated leafy plant this is pedilanthus or known as the devil's backbone beautiful dracaena plants dracaena plants also you have to keep in the partial to medium sunlight area do not over water this plant this is a permanent low maintenance plant without fertilizer also you can grow them make sure you keep them in the shady corner one of the plants comparatively little bit expensive when you go to bring them from the nursery so make sure to keep them as a house plant or as an indoor plant or else when you place it in your garden make sure to keep them under the shade partial to medium sunlight area beautiful anthurium plants their leaves are also beautiful and also they are very very attractive the beautiful colorful leaves are decorative plants so have them around your home in your garden at the shaded area when you bring wandering jew plants make sure to keep them in the partial to medium sunlight area they are ideal for hanging baskets these beautiful variegated leafy plants when growing beautiful alocasia plants and if you put them in the ground you will see that their growth is amazing they grow really very beautifully and healthily these plants also love the corner in your garden where they can get the shade sunlight so this is also another beautiful plant look at this the leaves are huge i only brought a very small plant and now the size is so huge of this so i have put it in a corner in my garden where they get the partial to medium sunlight there are many varieties this is one variety with me and the bright light area is not that good for these plants aloe vera plants aloe vera is a succulent and it needs certain amount of sunlight but in your shaded corner in your garden they will grow really very beautifully these plants when exposed to too much of sunlight their leaves of the plant turn yellow and the gel also get dried out so you can keep this in the shade as well this is an ideal house plant which purifies the air and there are many benefits of keeping this plant with you so in your garden in a shady corner or in a bright light area you can grow this but i suggest you keeping it at the shaded to partial medium sunlight area when you bring beautiful philodendron plant stems keep them in the shade partial to medium sunlight area is ideal because these plants are also shade loving plants one of the best house plants and also low maintenance and permanent if you can see my plant is touching the wall now so it's grown so huge this plant is a shade loving plant friends so keep it in a shady area and also this is another beautiful house plant which prefers the shade do not over water this cc plant and you can maintain it at home also because this is a best house plant snake plants also love the shady corner in your garden these are beautiful house plants and also air purifier plants you can keep them in the shady corner in your garden as an outdoor plant spider plants spider plants also love the shaded partial to medium sunlight these plants grow well in the partial to medium sunlight bright sunlight cannot be tolerated by these spider plants because these spider plants leaves are sensitive and they are not good for the bright light area so these plants can tolerate medium to partial sunlight so the shady corner is ideal for the house plant beautiful spider plant so there are many videos which i have uploaded in my channel with your time you can watch them to get more information first but not the least this is sansevieria which grows really well indoors as a house plant and also this is an best air purifier plant this is erica palm which works as a air purifier and also one of the best indoor plants one of the house plants that is best for your entrance also so friends today i covered up about growing house plants indoors which are best for your shaded corner and all about the house plants which loves the shade if you have kept them outdoors so i hope you find this video very useful if you do please don't forget to give it a big like and share it with your family and friends subscribe for more upcoming gardening videos to tamara's garden channel